Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name's Kimberly, and if you are new, welcome. Please don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you do enjoy this sort of content and in you like me or whatever. And also don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you are enjoying it. Anyway, today's video is gonna be kind of an exciting one for someone. Obviously you're watching this because you're going on a holiday like, oh, or you're just watching it for the fun. That's what I do still because I have the worst holiday blues. Like I've been back for a month now and I just, I wanna go back on another holiday. Like why do I have to work? And you know, why can't I just travel the world? Like it's my goal, but Today's video is pretty much going to be me showing you what I did take to Europe, what I regret taking, what I wish I took, um, and I'm pretty much just going to give you some pointers at the start. I'll go into a little bit more detailing in what I did take, um, and you'll see me unpacking and showing all the clothes and whatnot. But let's get into the tips. I did write some on my phone, so if I'm looking down, that's what I'm looking at, but I have so many different thoughts in my head that I kind of wish I knew before I went. So if you're going on a holiday, I really hope all these tips helped you because there's so many things that I kind of wish I knew but I guess that's the point of traveling like you just find so much out and like I feel like you can never be fully prepared like never um, what I wish I took was like a bag like this a duffel bag because on this trip itself even though I was doing a Kentucky trip I really wish I took like a duffel bag because a duffel bag like this itself when you buy things you have room to put it in my suitcase was packed to the brim if you guys saw my other video I'll link it here but you guys would have seen my suitcase was packed to the brim I honestly didn't think I would buy anything I ended up needing a bag like this because on my Kentucky trip itself there were places that I actually had to leave my suitcase on the bus because they didn't have a lift or it was really hard to cart around on the ferry so I definitely recommend taking a bag like this I wish I knew and I wish I just took one I thought of taking a bag like that but I just was like no I've got my backpack and I've got my suitcase that's enough for my carry-on and also coming back to like I could have checked that in um, instead of having to waste my money and buy one over there like I just wish I took one because like you really did need it and I wish they told you before you went <laughs> even if you're not going on a Kentucky trip I definitely recommend taking like a spare bag my next tip is to pack for all types of weather like you think you're going to go to Europe and you think that I'm going to be wearing summer dresses and everything like that there are so many parts of Europe that rained and I was there in summer like July and June like London was so cold even Paris was freezing and Germany and Austria and Switzerland and everything like that I definitely think packing a blue and a black pair of jeans will be so good for you unless you're going to just more tropical places I guess it would be different but even nights were really cold I just thought Europe maybe because I'm Australian but I just honestly thought Europe would be like here um here it's currently winter and I'm in a dress you know just be aware of that another one tip is like I wish I took more basic clothes I wish I took like an oversized black t-shirt or, or a white t-shirt or a long skivvy like I just wish I took more plain color things so I could mix and match and I wish I'd kind of laid all my outfits out before and was like this top can go with that 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 like I just wish I packed more versatile items another tip is I really wish I packed like loose clothes because if you think you're gonna go on holidays and not gain weight you're gonna need a reality check because you put on a bit of weight I would say allow like looser fitting clothes so in the middle of the trip when you put on a little bit of weight or you eat too much pasta um, you can wear those items because for me I took clothes that like just fit before I went on my holiday I actually gained like three kilos and then when I went overseas I gained another five kilos so half of my clothes didn't fit nicely you guys will see that from me saying it from the clip but I definitely wish I took like loose denim because no one wants tight denim like when you have tight denim and you go out to dinner you can't really eat that much so I definitely say take looser denim and also take like a few looser tops too dresses are pretty good like I feel like as long as it fits you on the bust majority of the dresses have a little 
little bit of extra room on the skirt bit I guess I also wish I took more dresses I'm such a dress person like I don't know what I was thinking going into this like I just wish I took more dresses I actually took 10 which for some people it's a lot but I was there for just under two months so I really did need more dresses because I wore some of them out and then I wore some during the day you're not just gonna wear one outfit a day like nine times out of ten you'll put a different outfit on at night um, because you'll just be like sweating in your clothes or you'll be really cold and everything like that I would say I wish I took more dresses and I wish I took more like baggy t-shirts like more lazy wear clothes because when I was on the bus that's all I wanted to wear I just wish that I took more comfy clothes I guess another thing is just take one black denim shorts and one blue denim shorts like just don't try and take heaps of different things like you just need a black or a white or a blue item like you just need two of each denim basically another thing is I kind of wish I didn't take as much gym wear too because I took a pair of shorts that I wore once I also took two gym shirts that I never wore and and I also packed like a pair of tights that I never wore with a holiday like this basics are your answer just pack something plain just pack something black white gray like I just wish I did that another thing is Another thing is pack some warm trackies or some warm um, pajamas and everything like that because they don't give you much bedding in Europe. Like everywhere you go, unless you're staying in like really fancy hotels and everything like that. But I found myself at night so cold. Like I would wear a jumper to bed quite often because in Europe it does get really cold at night. I would just recommend taking some trackie pants. They're really good to have. They're also just really good for like flying and just like lazy day clothes basically um, on the way from Sydney to London I was freezing on the plane like I was so damn cold I had two blankets at this stage like I asked the flight attendant for another blanket because I was so cold like I had a jumper on and I had my tights but I just found I couldn't get warm so next time I'm on a plane I'm wearing tracky pants and I do not care <laughs> Alright, so there are all my tips so far. If I have any more, I'll leave them in the comments down below and I say a few while I'm like talking through myself unpacking and everything like that. Yeah, let's get into the next part. I'm going to be doing a different video right now. This is an overview of all of my clean clothes that I packed to Europe. This is the suitcase that I bought there that I wish I bought here. So it's, I think it's a 70 centimeter one and it ended up being really, really good. It was quite damaged, but I love this suitcase so much. It got me through Europe. So let's get started. This is the item of clothing that I didn't wear. One tip I will give you, if you probably haven't wore this piece of clothing at home, in the past six months or even like almost three months there is no point in you taking it unless it's like seasonal obviously but I needed a second pair of tights and I definitely did and I wish I didn't take these I didn't wear them I was like these will be fine because at home if I'm walking I may wear them but honestly there's no way because I only really had like one top that would go with this to be honest it was just too much of a powerful pattern and I didn't feel comfortable like wearing them on the bus and whatnot so I wish I just took like a second pair of black tights or even like a gray or like a darker color pair of tights I wish I didn't take those because I didn't wear them obviously um this next top there's this like singlet gym top that I also didn't wear I don't know where my tripod is right now so I'm doing this all with my hands to be honest like if I'm working out it wasn't warm enough for me to wear that and I wasn't getting my sweat on I was just walking I would just wear a t-shirt so I would wish I didn't take this this was kind of pointless taking just a gym top like I wish I took more of a versatile t-shirt like bike rides and anything like that that we did do like that was the only form of exercise we really did besides walking every day I just wore like a t-shirt or a jumper because it was actually semi-cold in some parts in Europe the next thing I took is like a tight singlet top and this singlet sits quite high up I'm a little bit insecure with my body to be honest like I didn't feel comfortable wearing this 
this because what a lot of people don't tell you is, which is obvious, but like when you go to Europe, you put on a fair bit of weight. Like I put on five kilos. So a lot of these clothes were quite tight on me at times and I didn't even feel comfortable wearing them or I just felt really crap. So I wish I took clothes that were a little bit bigger on me. So then like if I did put on that five kilos, the clothes would be a little bit looser. I would get more use out of them and everything like that. So this is just like a singlet top and you would just wear this with like a denim skirt, denim short, anything like that. Because the denim was quite tight on me, I wasn't wearing anything tight up top because you would see a little bit of my fat. So I wasn't going to wear something like this and then like wear something tight because I'd feel really insecure because I had put on that weight. I've had this for three years. I've never wore it. Like I don't understand why I thought, oh, take it to Europe. You know, I'll magically wear it. But it's just like, I don't know, sometimes you have to wear clothes in, like wear them once. But there was never once that I thought that I could wear this with any outfit. Like I just didn't feel comfortable. And thinking now I could have just wore this with like a, even like I could have wore a t-shirt or anything like that. I just didn't like the way this skirt looks on me. Last minute, like the night before, mum was like, you need to take a going out skirt. And I was like, gonna take this other black denim skirt. And she's like, no, it's too short. So then we thought, okay, let's take this. I wish I just took the denim skirt, to be honest, because I had so many tops that I could wear that denim skirt with. And I just, it was like so heavy too. Like I could have honestly taken like three dresses instead of that. That, all the things that I didn't wear. The next thing is my nighty took a t-shirt dress. To be honest, I just wish I took like a tracky pants and a t-shirt or something like that because some places this was really good, don't get me wrong, but everywhere we went, it was so cold and like they wouldn't give you much like bedding and anything like that. And when it's really cold, you just want your trackies. Um, don't get me wrong, in Italy, Croatia, Mykonos and everything, this was a lifesaver because it was so hot. But when we got to like Germany and Paris, and everything like that it was kind of cold and on the plane it's so cold so I wish I just bought tracky pants instead of this so I'm gonna go through all of my dresses now I'm gonna let you know how many times I wore them if I would retake them and everything like that what I'm gonna do is these dresses majority of them I have photos on my Instagram so but this is a dress that I actually bought I think I was in Austria so I bought this dress and I actually saw it in Spain and they didn't have my size and I was like oh it was from a store called Mango and then I looked in a few different stores Mango's while I was out through Europe and I found it so I ended up finding it at the end of the trip but I managed to wear it twice which was really good um so I'd definitely take that again I really liked that there was a lot of room and everything like that like I think when you're traveling you just need loose and comfortable clothes that's well, that's what I've gathered from this six weeks the next thing is like a jumpsuit so it's a little bit like that I'll insert the photo here I don't regret taking this don't get me wrong but I wish I just wore it early on the trip because this itself I felt really insecure because when I first wore it so I first wore it and I was like confident I was like yeah perfect I was in Austria so I had been sick previously so I had lost that weight that I put on so in Austria I was really confident in it I loved it don't get me wrong but it took me a while like we were already four weeks in on that trip before we wore it so I wore that one twice so I wore it in Austria and I also wore it in Amsterdam okay so the next one is like just a dress a floral dress I'll insert a photo of it because I wore it once and I regret taking that to be honest because it doesn't wash well so when I washed it it like kind of went like that and I washed that when I was away too like I liked it it was cute but it wasn't flattering so that's why I regret taking it and it just wasn't as versatile too like I definitely have other dresses that are cuter that I would have wore more but I just didn't take them. The next one is this like polka dot dress, if we can see that. Anyway, I'll insert a photo. Love that dress. Wore it twice um, to two formal events. Really comfy, really good. Don't regret it at all. One of my favorite dresses I own. The next one is just like a, a day floral dress. Loved it. Yeah, I wore that dress three times. So it was just really comfy. And I, a few times I mixed it up. So I wore like a t-shirt under it. Definitely like a really good day dress. I think when you're traveling, you just need like loose fitted clothes. Okay, the next one, which I hate myself about, to be honest, because I bought this especially for Mykonos. Like, isn't it such a Mykonos vibe? And then I was really sick in Mykonos. <laughs> And then when we went out, I we were going out clubbing. So I was like, this isn't really like clubbing. So I didn't really get to wear it in Mykonos and get my like photo in the white building. But I don't regret taking it because I wore it on a cruise in Croatia and it still was like really comfy. I also wish I wore this more early on in my trip. I was trying to save it for Mykonos, but we didn't even get there. Yeah, I found that with some clothes. I was saving it for like certain events and then you never wear them. So try not to do that, to be honest. The next dress... 
I don't regret taking at all. It's just like a dress that I wore to Monaco um, when we went to the casino, so it was quite fancy. The only thing is, it's quite bulky, so that was the annoying thing, but I don't regret taking it. I got a cute pic in it, and I love the color, and I thought it was good. First time I've actually washed this dress, so it's like shrunk. Don't regret taking this, but oh, actually, maybe I do a little bit, because I hadn't wore this dress before, but the buttons actually pull, so when you sit down, they pull. So I like it because I wore it in Venice and I got a really cute pic, but I don't think I would retake it with me. Love this dress, don't regret taking it at all, would repack it in a heartbeat. It's just your good old, like, cute little boutique green floral dress. I wore it twice, once in Paris and around maybe in Austria, I think, maybe, but I did wear it twice and I love that dress. Next one, wouldn't repack it. Yeah, I regret taking it. I did wear it, so obviously it got somewhere but this was actually a little bit tight on me when I did wear it. I'll insert the photo of me at the Colosseum wearing it but it is something that's like really lightweight. It just got really tight on me. I kind of wish I wore it early on or saved it when I had lost that little bit of weight in my trip but I didn't know but yeah. I wish with my dresses I just took more flowy dresses. This is just like a shift dress. It's orange. I wore it in Florence and I think I wore it once more. So I wore it twice. I don't regret taking it. It's a really cute dress. It was a little bit tight on me so I wish it was a little bit bigger. Next two things don't regret at all. Definitely if you're going to Europe you need two pairs of jeans I feel like. Especially if you're going like June, July because if you're just going to like say places like Greece or Croatia honestly you're sweet without them but at the start of the trip I wore them so much like every day almost and they're good for like the bus and everything like that and then at the end of the trip I wore them a few times too. So this is just like plain black jeans jeans um and then these were like a little bit like cut and then they had that raw hemming on the end but yeah definitely love that I took a black and a blue pair like I did something right <laughs> moving on to some more denim I regret like I have these pairs of shorts and these pairs of shorts I definitely did not need two blue denim pairs of shorts. I could have done without. These were a little bit loose, so they weren't heaps tight at least, but I found it restricting with what I wore with them. Like, I could only wear plain things, and I just didn't love them, to be honest. Like, I just took them for the sake of it. Um, and these jeans... They were tight on me, like, pretty much the whole way through. Again, not sure why I took them. I do like them, don't get me wrong. I love the style of them, but I just, like, never wore shorts. I'm not a massive short person. I'm more of a dress, skirt kind of girl. I just never felt 100% confident in shorts. I think because, like, these ones weren't quite tight on the waist. So I didn't really, I think I wore these twice. I wore those ones twice. So four times. Definitely could have just packed one blue pair. These black ones, however... Love them, love them, love them. Probably wore them 10 times. I'm not even doubting that at all. I wore these out. I wore these during the day. I wore them so much and they were just really loose fitted. Like that's why I wore them so much because they were so comfy and they were just really loose and like they're quite big on me actually. Like these are a 14. I could have got a 12 but I'm glad I got the 14 because I would have wore them. But yeah like me now going back to my everyday life I could have just easily got a 12 but when you're on holidays you want things bigger. So love these so much. I wore these so much. So many of my tops went with this. I had a few black bottoms but heaps of my tops went better with black than blue. Like you can't wear like a blue short with like these camo tops. It just didn't look good. So love these. Definitely pack a blue and black pair of shorts and make sure they're a little bit loose because that's where you're going to notice the most. Another skirt. Love it. Wore it about five times I would say. Really comfy. Really lightweight. The only thing is it was a little bit see-through. Love this. Would repack it again and don't regret taking it at all. Next thing. Honestly I wore this skirt like every second day. Everyone on my tour was probably like this girl wore it so much but that's because I didn't love my shorts you know. And I wore this out too and you could wear this camis and it was fitted nice. It was a little bit tight midway through after Italy because I ate so much pizza. But yeah, I really love this. If I had a blue one, I would pack a blue one because the A-line skirt's quite flattering on my body. But love this. 
would repack. I also had another blue denim skirt. It did get a little bit tight on me. I don't know where it is at the moment, but I'll insert a photo of me wearing it here. I don't regret taking it. The only thing is it was just tight on me. So I only really got to wear it about twice. So that's all like my bottoms, my dresses. Let's move on to top. So we just got this like crochet top. I wore it once. So I don't know if I would repack it. I don't regret wearing it, but it's just not like something I got heaps of wear out of because this itself is quite kind of see-through. So I would wear like sort of skirt with it. And because my denim was quite tight on me, it didn't look heaps good. And I only found that I would have wore this in Croatia or Greece or whatever. So I don't regret taking it, but it's something that I wish I wore more of. I don't know if I would retake something like that, but like with clothes, you've obviously got to understand that everyone's body is so different. So things that I like, you may not like and vice versa. Next thing is just a black cami top, just like a little cow lick. Don't regret taking it, like it, very good. Wore it about three times maybe, if that, maybe twice. Next one is just like black and white polka dot cami top. Don't regret taking it, wore it about twice. Would repack it. This, I liked it, don't get me wrong. It was a little bit tight on me and because it's quite short, I only really wore this one. I don't know if I would retake it but it was like a good steep but you would just wear this with like the black or blue shorts you couldn't wear it with that black button skirt because it was like too much button so I don't know I'm on the fence if I would retake it but I don't regret it all right so next one is just a black halter top I think I only wore this once again because it's quite short and I wore it with my black high-waisted shorts don't regret taking it would repack it but I would only wear it clubbing and I would just wear it when I was feeling skinnier. I don't even think I wore this top. I'm unsure because I feel like I may have, but I'm just not sure. And if I did, it would have been once. At home, I wear this like quite a lot because I have like a black denim skirt that you don't have to like tuck in. The button denim skirt I took, you had to tuck stuff in because it looked a bit weird. So you could just wear this out loose. So I think I wouldn't repack it again if I wasn't taking like a plain black skirt because that's all I really wear it with and it's quite shorter. The next two, love them. Love this wore this so many times it was just like a red cami honestly I probably wore this about three times and one of my friends borrowed it and she wore it black and white version of it loved it wore it wore it about twice twice to three times I think one of my friends borrowed this one too these were really good I liked them because like you could wear them out and it wasn't too dressy or under dressy um these next two things I actually bought in London but I'm going to include them because I wore them so much in my trip just like a, a white clingy top basically and you have like the curled up sleeves. I wore this a lot under my dresses and we just have a black version of that and this I wore with like my like black skirt a lot so would repack these. Love that. Not sure why I didn't pack them from Sydney. I wore this twice. Do I regret taking it? Yes because I didn't feel 100% wearing it and because it's a bodysuit. I never wear bodysuits but it's just something you have to worry about when you travel and sit on the bus and everything like that I just I didn't love it like I don't know maybe it would be different if I wore it with jeans but I didn't love it with the skirt I just thought it made me look bigger so I wouldn't repack that honestly just wore it for the sake of wearing it so love the idea of taking a long sleeve top I did wear this twice but I meant to pack my black and white one wish I did because that's a little bit more versatile like I never would have wore this with like my jeans or anything like that like tucked in I would have probably wore the black one with black jeans because I feel like it was black so it was a little bit more flattering whereas this is like an almost white color so it's not as flattering but I don't regret taking it I just would take this in a different color t-shirts to be honest I didn't take enough t-shirts I took five but I definitely could have taken more this is just like a band tee t-shirt don't regret taking this wore it only twice because a girl on my trip had it so it was a bit awkward if I wore it and then she wore it you know because I was one day and we both wore it and I was like okay I'm done <laughs> next one is just like a striped t-shirt with New York on it don't regret taking it was comfy wore it on the bus a few times i probably wore it about three times i just wish i took more t-shirt because on the bus that's all you want to wear is t-shirts and ties
tights or jeans in short. Love this t-shirt because it's black and oversized. I just hate the fact that it said track. I wore this honestly 10 times. Like this would have had to be my most worn top. So good because it's oversized. So no matter what weight I put on, you wouldn't be able to tell. You wore it so much. Wish I took a few different ones like this because I would have wore it so much. Next one. Love this. Probably wore this about five or six times at least. Just like a really nice oversized t-shirt from Thrills. I'll have a photo of me wearing it. Just really comfy and it fit in nice material. And yeah, like I said, I wore this at least five to six times. All right. Next one is a t-shirt. I wore this three times, but I actually only bought this in Austria. So if I took something like this at the start of the trip, I would have wore it more, I'm guessing. But yeah, like it's pretty good considering I bought it three weeks in it and I had already wore it three times. Next thing is just like a plain black cardigan. I don't know. I don't regret taking it. I would repack it. Don't get me wrong. But I only wore this twice because I didn't want to take a jacket with me out. Next thing is something I lived in. Like honestly, just a gray jumper. I wore this like five to six times it was so good to have because when it was really cold in like France I wore this and even sometimes I wore it to bed because it was really cold at night we have my Kentucky hoodie I'm going to include this too um, I got this in Italy and I did wear it a ton too I also took another gray hoodie which I can't find but I probably wouldn't have taken the gray hoodie if I knew I was getting this one I just didn't think of it I still wore them both don't get me wrong I definitely could have just got away with like not packing a hoodie and buying the Kentucky hoodie because I also had this jumper too and I had like long sleeve tops I could wear under. I packed two lots of swimmers and I didn't swim that much. I just swum a total of four times. So I definitely could have got away with just packing like one lot of swimmers. But this was the girl that I loved so much. Pretty sure I wore this maybe three or four times. Love that swimmers. The next one were these like green ones. I only wore it once. To be honest, I could have got away with not taking them because I felt a little bit insecure around this bust area because I went really low and it had a weird cut but I'm just glad I took this and I would only take one next time. A lot of my friends only brought one pair of swimmers and it was honestly fine I think unless you're spending like a week purely in Mykonos or something like that I think one lot of swimmers is sweet. Next thing is like an athletic t-shirt. This fit me okay but I couldn't get my maximum wear out of it because it was a little bit tighter. I don't regret taking it. I wore it maybe about three times but yeah like I said I just wish I took more oversized t-shirts definitely could have got away with not taking these I wore them once I liked them I just feel like I just wish I took like one full length black pair of tights and then one like three quarters because I would have got more wear out of like black I only wore these once and it was for a bike ride and I definitely could have got away with just wearing like normal full length tights because it ended up raining and I was cold oh this must be the last one it's just like black tights I honestly lived in the I wish I packed another pair like I said but yeah they're just like black tights from cotton on body this is the kind of clothes you want to wear on the bus or like and like when you're doing some activities they were really good so that's all of my clothes there were two items that I missed but I told you guys and I'll insert as many photos as much as possible all right guys that is everything for this video I hope you guys did enjoy it if you are new please consider subscribing down below and also give this video a thumbs up if it did help you out a lot but I hope you have a lovely holiday if you are going on one and safe travels. If you have any like travel tips for me for like packing, leave them in the comments down below. Honestly, need to hear them. Like I feel like with traveling, there's always something new you can learn. So yeah, leave them in the comments down below and I hope you guys do enjoy the rest of your day. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.